وي وي yeah. وي now it is recording. Okay. <coughs> يعني uh, it's okay to say a little history on coronavirus at first. Okay. Yeah. Can I start? Yes, yeah, you go ahead. Okay, so um, I'm gonna relate a little history on coronavirus uh, at first. Uh, this virus has been named coronavirus disease 2019 and abbreviated COVID-19 as the first tolerance of corona and the first tolerance of virus and the first letter of disease. That's why we, we say COVID-19. And uh, we first saw this virus in late 2019 in Wuhan, China. <clears throat> and uh, some people think it likely jumped from bats to camels before appearing in humans. And uh, coronaviruses are common in humans and animals. And they cause species infections by jumping from one host to another. And uh, as I just mentioned, some people think it likely jumped from bats to camels. Also, some people think that uh, it could be the traditions of eating rare and unusual wildlife uh, might be behind the outbreak and this pandemic. But you know, the most important thing is scientists right now are working on some vaccines for this disease. And uh, I think they are near to find a good one. Hopefully, they will find. That's it. And uh, uh, already we have some important uh, we have some important questions for today. Uh, the first one is: um, How did you deal with COVID nineteen in the beginning and now? And uh, what would you think in the first uh, at the beginning and now? And uh, secondly, do you test positive COVID-19 before? And uh, if so, what were the, sim uh, the symptoms and uh, how did you deal with uh, this pandemic or with this disease? And finally, what should the government do and people in Egypt with uh, this disease? That's it. But let's go back to the first question that we have for today. And how did you, uh, how did you deal with COVID-19 in the beginning and now. That's it. And let's go. The mic is with you, Mohammed, right now. Well, I still remember on the... On the Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim uh, uh, I still remember <coughs> on the 18th of March when my boss at work, she said to us that this is our last day at work from the office and then we will start working from home. And we didn't know how long this is going to happen, for how long? A couple of weeks, a month, two months. I thought that it's going to be for a few weeks. So I left everything, my cups of the, for the coffee and food and chocolates and things in the, in the drawers. Did you and grab them? Uh, sorry? Did you grab them? I so... didn't. No, <laughs> I, thought, <laughs> I thought we're coming <laughs> back soon. <laughs> So I, 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 okay. I, and a few months later, like May, June, I looked back and I said, how did this happen? We, we, we thought that it's, it's just going to happen for a couple of weeks and we're all going to be fine. And, and it went from a bad situation to a worse and it came to worse. And it was absolutely a big shock. And with yeah. the numbers, and we, we, we here in the UK, we had the highest numbers of of cases and death and death mm -hmm. uh, casualties in the world for, I think until today, uh, we almost uh, 75,000 uh, cases uh, of death. Yeah. Which I think the second after, after the US, after the American. So I myself, I, I was shocked. I didn't know what- So uh, I mean the, uh, the Great Britain of UK comes uh, at the second stage after the US. I think we are uh, uh, this, the, the number of this. I think I think we we are. 
it it in the beginning it was it was thought that maybe Spain and Italy are bad. And Italy, yeah. But yeah. it seems like England is <clears throat> still going badly to, to reach seventy five thousand cases of death. And why why, why it, things why, why why things go bad in nobody in knows. England. I don't know. <clears throat> it's it's a big question actually because in the beginning. I thought this is a pandemic, a worldwide <coughs> pandemic. It's not just about yeah. uh, America. It's not just about the UK. It's not about. It's not. India. It's not an epidemic, by the way. It's it wasn't. A pandemic. It's a pandemic. Yeah, yeah it's, it's yeah. a pandemic. So I thought it's a world pandemic. So I thought that it's across the world. So I thought that <coughs> all the countries of the world will collaborate, and uh, you will have all the universities collaborating and having and having a, a lot of. Uh, collaboration to have something, to have a vaccine or have some medicine. But it seems like each country dealt with the, with the, with the virus separately and differently. So I, I don't know why we have all of these numbers, maybe something wrong, maybe uh, something in the people, something. Hello, someone joined us. We can't, I can't see a name, Oppo. A one K. Yeah, I think uh, the voice uh, we can't we can't hear him. He can see us. We can, hopefully he can he can hear us as well. But uh, uh, yeah, it's it's very strange. How I dealt with it, we didn't have options. <coughs> we we moved from level to level. Today we yeah. are on level four. Which is the highest, the highest level of uh, of uh, uh, lockdown. So we can't go outside except for urgent. If you if yes. you go out, you go out, and uh, you must keep a distance, at least two meters <coughs> between you and whoever you're walking with, or you're speaking to, or you're coming by. Um, no gatherings, even two families. No two families can can gather. There were yeah. no celebrations for the new year in, in, in the households. Uh, Christmas is a big festival in the West. There was there was no Christmas meetings uh, for this year. So it, it, it was a shock and still getting, getting a, as a big shock. That's what I, yeah. I, so I didn't have a choice. So you have to stay at home. I'm working from home and uh, uh, I, I buy the groceries for the, for the house once a week. And go collect yes. them from the shop. Come back. So we don't go inside the shop. There is a, a point for collection outside. So I buy everything online, and go collect it and come back home. <coughs> That's it. Yeah. It's it's uh, no options. It's awful, by the way. No options. Yes. Yeah. We can turn to uh, another person. Ahmed, to tell us. Ahmed. Yeah, yeah, I listen. Uh, are you okay? Is there a coronavirus uh, there? I hope not. No, 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 no. This, this is the usual flu. No, no, no. Not to worry, man. <laughs> By the way, we are online. You're not. <laughs> <laughs> it will not move for you, by the way. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and no, no, this is the normal, uh, the normal case anyway. Uh, always. This uh, is a proof of uh, uh, online meetings. What? That's a prose of on, uh, pro, uh, <laughs> for, for what? For what we are talking today? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you can tell us uh, what do you think at first in the beginning and now? Uh, at the beginning, I was uh, in Saudi Arabia, Jeddah city. Yeah. Uh, I uh, I think uh, it was a lie for uh, and it, it will be end uh, for one week or two weeks uh, from now. Uh, 
except when when they told us uh, the you should work from home uh, i was alone my colleague uh, traveled to egypt i can't uh, because my work policy i was only one who support my, our system so i can't uh, leave the system for the work there so I uh, lived uh, alone for three months. That uh, was a big uh, interval and um, make me very nervous, make me very uh, uh, sad. Every time I, uh, I see the news, I feel that the world the uh, in the beginning uh, it's a catastrophe yes. uh, the news make things more more bigger so what 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 activities could you do during during those three months could you go to the shop could you go outside what what did you do i was living in uh, a hotel I was uh, go down to uh, shopping uh, to uh, uh, save the, uh, my needs for uh, five or six year, uh, days, uh, buy anything I want for uh, long term. I don't know uh, what will happen. Mm. So the Arabia closed for uh, 24 hours. For a long uh, days. Yes. Yes. In the afternoon, we I I can see anyone in the street. Oh, wow. In the middle of the day, no one in the street, no so cars, no people. All the people only, took it very seriously as well. Only office, yeah. only uh, office cops, <coughs> uh, uh, doctors, uh, even. Anything uh, uh, wouldn't uh, be uh, available to uh, to be uh, open. So uh, even so it pharmacy, was like <coughs> yeah, it's uh, uh, as you just m uh, mentioned and said, it's what it was like the beginning of the end. Yeah, but it's yeah, okay it's here in Egypt. It, it's not. <laughs> yeah, that's good. what that I found. That's how I found. I, after three months, I came to Egypt. I found uh, that uh, there is no coronavirus. Uh, it is a uh, uh, long-term uh, weekend. No work. No uh, one die for coronavirus. Everyone, every dies was a uh, usual die. So it was uh, it was very nice to feel that uh, it's a big lie. Even in yourself, you didn't uh, uh, you didn't you didn't uh, feel that, but you feel nice when everyone uh, actions uh, <coughs> like you. Danny. Let me, let me, uh, 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 life was uh, is beautiful. Uh, corona is lie. Uh, work is uh, continuous. What, Nothing. When, when did you come back from Saudi Arabia, Ahmed? What month? Uh, in May. Uh, in May. In May. Yeah. Before Eid al-Adha, Eid al-Adha. Yeah, May is, is like the middle of, of the pandemic in, in the whole world. Like, <coughs> it reached yeah. the peak. Not in Egypt, not in Egypt. Yeah, not yeah. Not, uh, <laughs> yeah. Till now, by the way, till now we, we do not feel that we are in a, a big... I was very uh, surprised, uh, to be honest, uh, that people are dying <laughs> all over the world. And the people are going through the lockdowns, and uh, thousands and thousands of people are dying here and in, in America and in uh, in the whole of Europe, because all all Europe now is affected, and they all through lockdowns: France, Germany, Belgium, 
uh, Holland, uh, all, all, all of Europe is on, in, in lockdown. And Egypt, there yeah, is yeah. nothing. And it's, <laughs> let me, <laughs> let me, <clears throat> let me, let me relate my, oh, my story with parties. We having funerals as normal. We having gatherings. We go to the coffee shop, which is the shop in the street, the metro. I know, the we, we have some some wedding festivals till now, and a, a, a lot of gatherings in these uh, fest festivals for weddings. You know. Yeah, no, that's that's. I think, yeah, I think like people will, will start thinking again now because the numbers are getting worse. We just say, we are, they just people here in Egypt, they say like, uh, we are Egyptians and uh, nothing can affect us. Uh, like we ate uh, full and tamia, so uh, nothing can affect our stomach. Yani, coats like this still, uh, still uh, be said here in Egypt. But <clears throat> okay. let me relate my story with the pandemic. Yeah, that was uh, the first, the, the first, uh, the first time I, I, I hear that about the pandemic. That was the last month uh, of my uh, service uh, in the military, and uh, the first, uh, at first, we we we, we were uh, we were joking uh, about that pandemic, like the cap was saying to one. Uh, to one of the soldiers, like, uh, yeah, we were, we were joking, not like it's a big lie, it will not come to Egypt, <coughs> and uh, it will not like no one will get, <coughs> uh, will get uh, positive or whatever, like the, the, the countries abroad, uh, and this. <coughs> Uh, th that was uh, uh, in the in the beginning, uh, and then when we uh, when we came to uh, the middle of the year, like in May and June and July, when we uh, when we saw the the uh, the number of this is still rising, that was like we we started to think that it's not a big lie, it's not a lie, it's something real, it's something true. And we should uh, take uh, precautions for uh, in order to uh, uh, in order to deal with that pandemic. That's it. That is concerning me, yeah. uh, mm. at least. Yeah. That's it. But now we are stuck in home, and we should believe that that we should stuck in home because if we don't do this, we will uh, at least if we will not. Uh, uh, like uh, coronavirus, and uh, some people see that uh, it, it it will not uh, it's uh, it's not affect like uh, children and youth, and I think people see that, but uh, uh, I don't trust these quotes, at least. But uh, and, uh, if we will not get positive, we will not get harmed or whatever. Yeah, and we will harm uh, elder people at least. And I think uh, the most, uh, oh, I think this virus uh, harms the elder people. And uh, as we see, like, yeah, at least in our community, in our village, okay, most of cases are elders or are elder people. That's yeah, it. Yeah, no, it does, it does affect the elders more than more than the younger ones <clears throat> but i think this is going to take us what you said now going to take us to the second or the next question that you you prepared is is the staying at home when you say that we should stay at home but what would you say to the people who can't stay at home the people that wouldn't like for example i can stay at home and do the work at home and go and do the shopping once a week from the shop from outside the shop and I, I have no contact with anyone because you have the facilities organized for you. So how how someone will stay at home and they will need to buy stuff and uh, as someone who like Zemahna bin Ul daily yes. daily workers, what 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 those people how they gonna stay at home and uh, who's gonna feed the children and do you think that com what the community can do to help those people? 
And I, I think this thing, uh, this, uh, yeah, I think this this thing turns to the government, and the government should do uh, what she what she uh, they want or what they uh, should do for people who just uh, who who work uh, every day or like like you said, yum uh, yum. Yes, and I think that I think turns to. Uh, comes back to the, the government. What do you think, Ahmed? I think everyone uh, works day by day. Uh, see that uh, there are uh, two uh, uh, routes and uh, the same end. The end is, is dying, uh, but the two routes is staying home and coronavirus. So, um, he see that uh, staying home will be uh, more fast type more than coronavirus. He will make me die and my children, my family. But coronavirus may, maybe, uh, maybe deadly, maybe not. Do you, do you encourage them to go outside and do the work as normal or stay at home? How, how they can do that? I encourage you to do outside. They can't go. You don't want we, them to go. Our country can't uh, encourage people to stay home, to, um, to uh, uh, to help them in uh, their life. Or their families, our country uh, forced them to uh, going outside to uh, make money to uh, for, their, uh, for their families. So yeah, I think in the, in the beginning it affect everyone. It was it was the same uh, it was the same concept to here as well. <clears throat> what they called it the 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 herds the herd immunity. The herd immunity, they, 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 it's like everyone goes outside, everyone gets affected, everyone builds the uh, self immunity mm. against the virus and then everyone is safe. But of course that was a myth, that wasn't right. And that's why they, they, they canceled <clears throat> this herd immunity option and they stayed home Schools are closed, universities are working online, or hybrid, the hybrid system, a little bit of uh, uh, face to face and mostly online. Shops are, shops are open for essentials and for necessity. Uh, restaurants are closed, pubs are closed, coffee shops are closed, everything is closed. But as I said in the beginning, there are facilities that you can live your life from home. But for a country like Egypt that was not or is not prepared for this situation, the shopping, I don't think people can do the shopping online and do go and go and do a good collection. And uh, we have, we have uh, families, the poor families, they can't, they don't have internet, they don't have uh, uh, the online shopping, they can't have delivery. It needs a huge, huge volunteer. In the beginning, I, I had, a, I had an, an idea of volunteering the youth, the youth of each village or of each city. They can, they can actually coordinate delivering these things to the people who can't go outside and get the stuff. We have hundreds of thousands of young people they can help without getting affected or getting anything. So they can receive calls, they can have like a center of help or volunteering center in, in a boxer, for example, and they encourage the, the, the hundreds of thousands of, of, of young people to come and help deliver food or water or whatever those households need for a week or two weeks. And people can help each other and that can be across the whole country, I, I, I think. But to, to send people outside for the community, for the economy to keep going, and they die, it's, 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 it's a big thing. 
very big thing. Yep. What do you think, yeah? Then you didn't say anything about this one. About what? About that second question. What do you what what what, what option? <coughs> yeah, it's it's uh, it's, uh yeah, no, it's really something difficult to say about this pandemic. But I think um, maybe you're uh, it, it's an option that you just said if the young people uh, donate like uh, to serve the elder people <coughs> it's a good option by the way but I think yani, uh, everyone can stay at home he should stay at home and he, uh, for most of people uh, I think um, you should go out for, uh, <laughs> you, you hear uh, the Muslim? Yeah. The masjid, masjid tarfaya or the masjid? No, no, no. The masjid jambina. Uh, any, any masjid? Masjid in the jambina. Here, jambina. Tana, tana. يعني مسجد بتاعكم انتوا بتاعوا الحج بدأوا يعني ولا مسجد مين؟ اه وانا عايز اقول لك كده بس انت اسمه ايه؟ مش عارف انت اكيد اكيد الرحمه اكيد انت ما شفتوش يعني لا اسمه المسجد الرحمه 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 يس فود كورنر لا لا اتس نوت ا كورنر نو اوكي اني واي انا It's anyway. just, uh, I, I thought it's a tarfaya. Let's get tarfaya. No, no, it's not tarfaya. <coughs> anyway, but it's good to hear uh, that. Go back. Yeah, okay, let's listen. I think he finished. <coughs> okay. Yeah, so what do you, what do you think? Can happen, or how how can we can people and the government help in this situation? Yeah, I think the government here in Egypt uh, they give money for people who do not work. It's a good solution, but it's not enough. By the way, uh, so um, if you can't stay at home. Because you do not have enough money or enough food or whatever, so in that case you can go out and you can work and you should take some precautions. Um, that's it. But if you can, if you have enough money, if you uh, have enough food, and uh, uh, that's it. So you can stay home. You should out, not should. You must stay home. Mm. That's it. Yeah, that's that's fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. Yeah. What what do you so, think, uh, Ahmed? I don't think Ahmed said uh, what can happen and what the government <coughs> can do. What people? Do you think that the government can help in this situation, Ahmed? What, what can they? In some cases, I feel that the government uh, help us. Well, some situation, some other situations, I feel that uh, uh, the God help us. In the on the hand of the government, maybe uh, uh, they do uh, what they can mm. from uh, preventing the people uh, uh, to um, uh, be in the home and um, um, Help the people who day uh, work day by day to uh, go to their works um, because they already know that uh, they can't help uh, th those people. But I think Ahmed, yani, in a, in a, uh, so wait a minute, please. Yani. Uh, we don't have here in Egypt. We don't have um, an economy like. Uh, the American economy or the British economy or whatever because that's so the government here in Egypt can't take uh, decisions or take actions 
yeah uh, like like the take in america or like the take in england that's a point because we do not have a big economy yeah so that's so uh, mm. i think they are working as they can as uh, yeah. it's valid here in egypt that's it yeah i think they they, they don't want they don't want to say very frankly that we don't have the money to help everyone but yes. people should understand it without the government say it verbally you know what i mean yes so so rich people oh uh, i think yeah, I mean, uh, rich people should donate for poor people as much as they can so, yeah. so it's a it, it's an option i think in order to help people in order to help the country and all to go through this uh, pandemic no yeah and no, that's uh, it's it's a fair fair point that there is no better cause than this cause for people for the rich ones to give to the poor yeah yes yeah so uh, yeah yeah we can so uh, we can get it to the question that says you test positive before yeah can i, I have that question I, I haven't I haven't tested at all, but, but Alhamdulillah, and you will you will get inshallah. Alhamdulillah, so 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 far, <laughs> I was thinking about uh, having having it just to make sure. So that... yeah, 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 you have uh, experiences with the, as you, uh, your friend got uh, or as your friend tested positive, and uh, how did he feel, and how yeah, did first... he suffer from? Yeah, the first, the first one that uh, tested positive of uh, someone I know, he he's one of the guys that I play football with in uh, on oh. Saturday morning. He yeah. didn't. I I was texting him randomly like, "How are you?" and "How are you doing?" And then he said that he's in lock, he's in isolation, and he tested positive. And uh, he's a lovely guy. He's, he's I love him very much. So I, I was worried about him, but he didn't. He he gave me like the normal symptoms: the the fever, uh, the weakness. Uh, he can't do anything, and uh, he's afraid, and he's he's very afraid that something is gonna happen and he's gonna die, and <coughs> and uh, because of the isolation. But I, I I texted him a couple of weeks after that, and he was he was fine. Yeah, great. But thank God. How I, old? How old? How old is that person? He could be in his late 30s. In his late 30s, mm. beginning of his 40s, something like that. He's not, he's not old, he's very young. But for, for, for yeah, and alhamdulillah, I haven't, I haven't had the experience of being in touch with someone who, who mm. tested positive and died. Alhamdulillah. alhamdulillah. And I, because this, is, this, is, this would be a big shock. If, if you know of someone of a friend or family member or someone you know and he or she uh, tested positive and they suffered with the virus yes. and they died i haven't i haven't had this and inshallah and i i, I pray to allah subhanahu wa ta'ala i don't i don't live to this moment and i have an experience of dealing with someone who tested positive and uh, hear about their experience okay so uh, that's inshallah yeah. okay can we ask uh, Ahmed so you you tested positive before or not no I was in Jeddah okay, so... I, 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 I was living alone uh, <coughs> I, uh, I didn't uh, I didn't be, uh, tested it before uh, even uh, when I came back to I'm Egypt gonna, I'm, I'm gonna speak in experience from my experiences till uh, right now it's okay because okay so yeah me uh, as i said uh, yeah, maybe i'm maybe gonna, can wait I'm to gonna speak maybe you can wait okay. we, we can listen to your experience in the second uh, in the second, the second part the second okay. part because we have one minute so maybe we can join uh, again please uh, okay but it was Let's an interesting, interesting interesting talk in the first part <laughs> It's okay. Okay, see so you let's guys. Let's go and come back. Bye. Bye.